Assalamualaikum to everyone Today I'm going to present to you GDT211 Graphic Communication 2 By me Nuri Shafira binti Sharafizam from class KAD11138 We start with the contents My map, corporate identity and image Task 1 research on specific company mood board Task 2 logo, sketch and final Logo rational, logo application Task 3 corporate event campaign item and packaging design Stationary set, packaging Task 4 poster and the final project or promotion or promotional items My map Corporate identity We have letterhead, envelope, business card, receipt, packaging, uniform and merchandise Corporate image what is corporate image? Corporate image is a target audience focus which consumer are principally interested in this price and quality and reliability of the company product and services. Product reputation is the frame with the various audience that important to it. The financial community and the shareholder will have many of the same financial and strategic concern about company. The ultimate aim of the company is to exactly aim alignment the corporate identity and the corporate image. That is, the public view the company exactly as the company want to be seen. Public relations personnel protect and promote the company corporate identity to create a corporate image in people's mind. The image that stakeholders have the company will influence their willingness either provide or with own support. Research number one. Mubot. Mubot start with product. The subject I choose is cotton candy and I name it Pro Fruity Bloom. Product description. A freshly spun cane sugar and honey confection that resembles cotton contains small amount of flavoring and the candy is made by heating and liquefying sugar spin. It sacrifices to mean hope. Sugar rapidly cools and becomes the fine strain. Name We have 21 names. First, we start with Google. Gula Kapas from Malaysia Fairy Floss from Finland Sugar Spider from Netherlands Papa Beard from France Dragon Beard from China Sugar Spin from Norway Candy Floss from England Bird Nest from Myanmar Sugar Cotton Fluffy Candies Delicious Floss Fairy Cloud Fairies Floss Rainbow Treats Rainbow Paradise Thin flossy, sweet and treats, cotton cloud, sticky candy, cotton hive and fruity bloom. USP Fruity bloom dissolve in the mouth, not in your hand. It has soft, sweet, fluffy and colorful texture. Sword S the logo which speaks to the company. Oops, we speak to the customer and attract them especially youngster will be keen on the logo attract price range so that everyone willing to buy w high gear innovation uh, cost has occurred the invention new cotton candy to attract the customers not suitable for diabetes person to consume many and cost may be little higher because the pure honey is used not the sugar product can be sell on the website or the stalls even in higher economy crisis people are willing to buy this cotton candy t economy slow down competition with other cotton candy stalls the competitors grandpa joe's dandy candy fluff paradise Cotton C, Fairy Floss, Granny, Angel Floss, Malut CC, Fun Sweet, and Double Bubble. 
color scheme I use is pastel color example like light blue pink purple typography I test is 12 but in the end I choose master of comics the logo we search for cotton candy stationery receipt business card envelope letterhead merchandise sticker kitchen stocking safety pin and plushie uniform t-shirt and apron and the poster research we continue with number two logo design which is this is my logo fruity blue I use tagline sweet and fluffy My design use combination mark Which is my icon use 5 pieces rope Shape of a flower represent blue There is a bite mark on the bloom So the audience know that the product is a fruit Fruities mean the fruits will be used as an ingredient for this cotton candy Symbol design use drop shadow Opacity 80% dark blue Typography use is master of comic and elegant yet simple calligraphy suitable for this cotton candy logo design. Background for my logo use white opacity 60%. This peach and light blue color represent my corporate color for my product. We continue with logo design process sketch. Number 1, stage 1 and 2, thumbnail and rust. Sketch. We have 25 rough sketch. Stage 3 and 4 is my semi comprehensive and comprehensive sketch. Each 5 become 2 until become final sketch. Pretty blue. Continue. Logo design process final. Idea development, design development in AI. From five colors, icon, and my typography. And the final logo become the fruity bloom logo that I use right now. Logo rational. The concept. This logo is based on a flower. Among the design concepts are natural, appetizing, welcoming, exclusive, simplicity, friendly, and tasty. Font pastel color suit this cotton candy product logo. Font style. Font used for Fruity Bloom is a master comics. The font is calligraphic font which resemble elegant handwriting. They often look as if they were drawn with flat tipped pens and brushes. Occasionally, they will include the drip and spots, blotch and irregularities, characters of hand drawing letters. Color scheme, color scheme. Vivid tangerine. Peach is directly associated with the expression of the modesty and earnestity and innocence. Cornflower. Light blue is peaceful. Climbing color, according to the color physiology, blue is associated with trustworthiness and reliability. White, white represents purity or innocence. Some of the positive meaning that, right, that white can convey, including cleanliness, freshness, and simplicity. The design element is the icon and the typography. And I already said it before that. Continue with logo application, which is first original, black, white, black color outline, 10%, 3, 30%, 50%. The material I use for my packaging is plastic. Everyone, now we go with number three, item design, task three. We begin with stationary sketch that the sketch and idea development I made using Adobe Illustration design is all based on the reference. Stationary color progress. I make a random color because I want which one will be the suitable one for my 
corporate items. So, the madam proceed my file same like my color logo, which is the peach and the light blue. Next, we have packaging progress, sketch, semi-comprehensive, comprehensive, and my final is this. In the front, you can see I have logo, my tagline, those cotton candy made in Malaysia. On the back, you can see I have information, logo, tagline, my serving sizes, location of my address and the way to reach us my phone number and my company website and uh, now i'm going to present number four poster task four my poster sketch i made two because i have re my reference to continue we have semi-comprehensive i have eight posters the comprehensive, I have four. And the final one is this beautiful poster. Next is the final project, promotion or promotional items. Begin with merchandise progress, which is have stickers, keychains, phone cases, and the box. Merchandise progress. Merchandise final Uniform progress Sketch Semi-comprehensive And comprehensive And this is My final Uniform Next we have Marketing progress The banner The wobbler And the billboard And this is my final Marketing Thank you so much.